Our topic for this day is under quarter 3, week 9 of grade 7 math. So, ang lesson natin is to solve problems involving sides and angles of a polygon. Unahin muna natin yung under regular polygon. Okay, so, ito yung dalawang activities na ating isosolve today. Ito ay uh, um, credited to the following teachers. Thank you po sa mga writers, Madam Chrisel S. C. Bistante and Ma'am Marjorie Ingaran. You are watching Tutor Medge! Para sa ating activity 1, can you find me? Find the number of sides of a regular polygon with an exterior angle of 45 degrees and 25 degrees. So, kailangan natin dito ng chart na ito. Okay? So, ano ang ating gagamitin? We need uh, the formula 360 degrees over N. So, ano ang formula? Let's have here first, let X be the degree measure of one exterior angle of a regular polygon. So, i-denote natin na yung X, yun yung ating degree measure. Therefore, meron na tayong formula na X equals 360 degrees over N. So, kung i-cross-multiply natin ito, magiging NX equals 360 degrees. Ngayon, i-divide both sides by X para makita natin kung ano yung magiging value ng N. Okay? So, as simple as X divided by X, tatanggalin lang natin ito. Kaya, meron na tayo ngayong formula na N equals 360 degrees over X. Simulan na natin. So, let us solve. So, what are we going to do? We have to divide 360 degrees by the given exterior angle. Okay. Ano muna ang gagamitin natin? We have N equals 360 degrees over X. Now, for number 1, we have 45 degrees as the value of your x. So, ngayon, ang ilalagay natin dyan will be n equals 360 degrees over 45. Now, dividing 360 degrees by 45, our n now is equal to 8. Okay, so try naman natin yung number 2. We have 24 degrees as the exterior angle. Now, we just simply write there n equals 360 degrees over 24. Dividing this 360 degrees over 24, we get 15. Meaning, ang number of sides is 15. Now, intindihan mo ba? Now, let's have the activity to count me in. Find the measure of each interior angle of a regular polygon. With 5 sides and 18 sides. So, ano ngayon ang kailangan natin dito? So, this time, we need this formula. N minus 2 times 180 degrees all over N. Okay, so check muna natin ang ating formula. We let X be the degree measure of an interior angle. Okay, take note ha. Gamitin natin si X. So, ang mangyayari dito, we will have now the formula. X equals N minus 2 times 180 degrees all over N. Okay. Okay, so now let us start solving. So for our solution, we need to apply formula in finding the measure of one interior angle of a regular polygon. So ilagay natin yung x equals n minus 2 times 180 degrees all over n. Ngayon, for number 1, ang given ay 5 sides. So we replace n by 5. So meron na tayo ngayong x equals 5 minus 2 times 180 degrees all over 5. Okay, so ito, simplify muna natin yung 5 minus 2. So we have here now, x equals 3 times 180 degrees all over 5. Now we do first the multiplication here, dito sa numerator. So 3 times 180, we have 540 degrees. Divide it by 5. Now we get here 108 degrees. Ibig sabihin, ang measure pala ng isang um, interior angle, of a regular polygon with 5 sides ay 108 degrees. Now, let's do number 2. So, number 2, 18 sides naman ang given. Now, we have here x equals 
18 minus 2 times 180 degrees all over 18. So, ganun pa rin ang gagawin natin. Unahin muna natin itong 18 minus 2. So, we got there 16. Then, multiply it to 180 degrees. We have here now 2,880 degrees divided by 18. So, we got 160 degrees as the measure of the interior angle of a regular polygon with 18 sides. Naintindihan ba? Now, we're done with activity 1 and 2. Salamat sa inyong panonood. So, ngayon, kung hindi ka pa nakasubscribe, please do subscribe, like, and share this video. And then, abang po tayo for the next video. Like and subscribe, tutor meds, happy learning!